Hi there, this is Alan with kickstartcommerce.com and in today's tutorial, I want to help you answer the question of whether or not you have a mobile friendly website by using a simple tool provided by the Google Search Console. And so uh, one of the things that Google provides is this free mobile friendly test is your web page mobile friendly and so essentially all you have to do is enter in a URL to test and then we'll run the test so the URL that you will go and visit is this URL here search.google.com forward slash test forward slash mobile dash friendly and so enter that into your browser and then it should take you to this page where uh, you should see exactly what you're looking at here which is the is your web uh, page mobile friendly question and then below that it is an input for the URL and then once you input the URL the, te uh, the run test button will appear and so it tells you a little bit about this tool um, and basically it's going to score our page and tell us whether or not the page is a mobile friendly um, website so obviously search engines um, especially with majority uh, I guess a good number rather of um, folks online are using mobile devices um, whether you're within the US or even outside of the US uh, a good number of folks are using mobile friendly uh, devices and so it behooves you to make sure that your website is mobile friendly so that um, it can be ranked accordingly so if for instance here I will show you um, what a page let's use a page that I know um, that I already know is not mobile friendly and so we'll run this test on this URL austinpurplemartins.com and purple martins are a um, type of North American swallow so a bird uh, and they are here in Austin and so I basically just put together like a little one page site um, that tells just a little bit about where you can find them at in Austin so but if you run the test then basically this will show up uh, captured basically just to make sure that you aren't a robot of any sort um, okay select all the squares with street sign let's see if I can select everything with the street sign in it there we go and so essentially it will then run and analyze the page uh, and then it will produce a list of items that you'll see here momentarily that will uh, tell you whether or not the page overall it'll tell you whether or not the page is mobile friendly but then it should give us a list of items um, to basically correct so we'll just wait here for a moment for it to complete uh, the analyze bit here And so this is a great tool um, even you know if you do have a mobile friendly page which I'll show you here momentarily we'll do um, just a page from kickstart because I know it's not fully optimized um, but you know it'll it'll you'll see the the glaring difference between um, this Austin mark purple martins.com and versus the kickstart uh, commerce.com tool and so we wait and we wait In the meantime, what we'll do, we'll actually go ahead and what I'm going to do is basically go and start another. Oh, there he goes. So something went wrong. Uh, so let's try it again. OK. 
Okay, we'll put in a new. And let's do something like, uh, let's just do something like this. And you can put in a complete, um, you can put in a complete URL or you can also put in a page. So if you wanted to understand how well a, a certain page was running, then you know you could do that as well. And of course it's going to verify and analyze. And then just uh, let's make sure that we put in the right, right URL there. Fetching the page, running the test. And there's, so there's the Purple Martin site. It's not optimized. Well, let's see here. Uh, Oh, something went wrong there. Well, we'll use another site that I know. All right. So I'll show you. I'll come back to that site in a minute. So here is the, the mobile-friendly test for kickstartcommerce.com. So it, you can see it says... It was tested on and then it gives the day and then the time and then you can see that it, the page is mobile friendly. You can submit that page to Google if you are logged in um, via uh, the search console and then basically you can view the details of the page and so it tells um, what, what resources couldn't be loaded um, and what other errors are in association with the page and so it says not all the page resources could be loaded which this affects and impacts how Google basically can understand and see your uh, website so you definitely want to fix those availability problems um, for any of the resources just so that it doesn't impact your search ranking so that being said it even gives you you know just a view of what the site looks like um, so that's that let's see if we can pull up another uh, site here. So let's see. Da, 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 da. We'll see if, if this one pulls up. Um, My goodness. And so that's the site that we were trying to pull up, and as you can see, it's not optimized for mobile. Um, So this is a perfect example. So this site, roundrockseoservices.com, is just a one-page lander. And as you can see, it tells you page is not mobile friendly. Um, and then it tells you what you need to fix. Um, and so it says, hey, the text is too small to read. Clickable elements um, are too close together. The viewport is not set. Um, and then you can read through you know, different uh, additional resources that are provided to be able to take your uh, I guess you'd say non-mobile friendly page or website and basically keep addressing the issues that are here until you can get it to basically say, hey, page is uh, mobile friendly. So I hope that this tool, this little neat tool here um, helps you to understand and, and get a good a good uh, understanding for whether or not your website is mobile friendly or whether your web page is mobile friendly and so use this tool from time to time like i said it's something that's easy high level that you can use you don't 
I mean, to, to fix some of the, the issues in terms of the technical issues, you will have to have a bit of knowledge there of knowing what to do and how to go about doing that. But um, let's say you pay somebody to make your web page mobile friendly or website mobile friendly. This is a good way to test whether or not uh, they said they did what they did. Um, that being said, I hope this tutorial helped you. Let me know if you have any questions uh, by leaving me questions or comments below the video. Also, please, please, please subscribe to uh, my YouTube channel. I drop a video every Wednesday uh, morning. And so each week I drop a video. Sometimes it's about search marketing. Sometimes it's about WordPress tips and tricks or fixes. Uh, other times it's often about how to use domains, so domain name investing strategies to help grow your business. Uh, so please do subscribe to the YouTube channel. Also, please visit kickstartcommerce.com. And in the right-hand side there on the website, uh, if you scroll down, please subscribe to The Daily Scoop. That's where I share daily insights, um, and you'll receive you know, basically instant access on need-to-know uh, domain marketing strategies to uh, grow your business. So I include things from promo codes, from list of domains expiring that day that may have be may be of interest to you. So um, I include those things and other resources. So that being said, that's it for now. See you in the next tutorial.